There was a witch that made a scary cauldron that scared all over the town. It was made of rainbow. What are you doing out here? Blood? Red paint? Red paint. Oh, she's scary. And and it always blocked it up on them, right? Oh my goodness. Boo! Boo. Okay, yeah. tell me what you're doing here and with it mommy. Them. Oh my goodness. And then we're trying to make a different cauldron. What are you doing right now? Is that the color of a cauldron? This is. Oh. Okay, Mommy, tell me about your creation. It's red and black. That looks like Halloween and blood. What are we making? Do you know, Annabelle? Yeah. What are we making? I'm, I'm making the Sorcerer Scary the Colors. Whoa, the Scary Sorcerer Colors? Okay. But what are we doing with all these bottles that you guys are painting? Oh, right. We're painting them. What are we going to do with them? Do you know? We're going to hang them on a tree. And the scariest ones make the scariest things. Oh. So it's going to be like a haunted tree? Yeah. Okay. But we're going to put it in the graveyard. Got it? In the graveyard? You have a graveyard on your property? Yeah, I'll come show it. She's going to come show it. Okay, hang on. Does that mean I have to get up? Okay, let's go. We're going to go look at the graveyard. I'm going to go look it at Annabelle's graves. graveyard. Flowers. It has graves and flowers. Ooh, scary. Are you not as scared to go in the graveyard? Yeah. Wow, I would be scared. Whoa, he lost his head. That's a, that's a scarecrow. A scarecrow? And this is another scarecrow. Your dad, Papa said the headless horseman came and got it. I think the reins took it out. That's what I think. Can you fix his head? And, and these are called gray flowers. Grave flowers? Yeah. Okay, can you fix his head? I don't know how. You don't know how? Okay. Whoa, look at all these cool pumpkins you made. Which one did you make? Well, I did make one that's like this. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go back to painting. Wait, whoa. What? Ooh, gross. You want to see the gross insides? Oh, it's been out here for a week. Don't touch that. That's gross. Come on. Let's go see what well, we're doing on the painting. <sighs> Does that look scary to you? Wait, wait, let's go down the part I will paint. This is one Annabelle painted. So you can paint all the rest if you want. Are you done painting? This is the tree we created. And they go all the way around it. And then she has it leaning up here. I can drop it without letting it fall. And then we're going to put glow sticks in it so it will glow at night. And she also has them on the pathway. And then we got this is tied up. There's five on each side. That's how many bottles we could find. All different designs by the kids. Well, and a little bit from Sarah. Then we've got this one on the other side to light the way up to our doorway so the trick-or-treaters won't get scared. Well, they might get scared, but I doubt it. We don't have very many trick-or-treaters here. I hope you all have a great day today. So what day do you trick-or-treat on? Because, you know, here in Utah, they're very confusing. It should be October 31st, but if it falls on a Sunday, they'll tell you to go out on a Saturday. Yeah, these kids aren't going out on Saturday. If they go out at all, it will be on Sunday. They usually just go to trunk or treat and then sit here and hand out candy to the kids. So they will be probably with me on Halloween night. I'm going to make it an early night, but still... Stay safe and healthy, and may God bless you always with abundance, good health, and prosperity. In Jesus' name, amen.